Hello there, I am Giant Cold with more Pokemon Crystal. In the last part, we took on the whole Asasakura and got here to Vinland City from Alvine City. So now we are in Kanto again. We were in Alvine City, which was Jota in the last part, being in the last part, but now we're in Kanto. So now we're here in Vinland City, and we're gonna take on the first gym, or the third gym actually in this case, but the first gym we're gonna take on in Kanto. I am actually recording, uh, not having to plug my um pro controller in my um in my USB port to keep it charged. Hopefully the battery stays. I think the switch the Nintendo Switch Pro controller has a great battery life, so hopefully it'll last. I don't have to plug it back in uh, in the middle of like a recording or something because I don't know if that'll mess up the calibration of the controller. Let's just hope for the best. I have Sanders up front because this is such a type Pokemon gym. Let's read the sign once again. It says Roman City Pokemon Gym, Waiter Lieutenant Surge, The Lightning American. Yeah. I'm gonna show the first battle the first battle I turn our battle and but the other two I will just skip to the end, you know, just to save time. Okay, let's talk to the vice giver. Real champion making. You lucked out this time. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. He has traps all set all around the gym. But heh <laughs> the traps aren't active right now. You'll have no problem getting to a Lieutenant Surge. Yeah, okay. Volmer City Pokemon Gym, okay, yeah. So you don't have to check these trash cans like you did in the original game, so that's good. You can go right to the gym right if you want. So, but I'm going to battle the trainers just for experience, I guess, to show them off, I guess, to show this one off, I guess. Lieutenant Surge, you recognize my potential, potential with which type Pokemon, with which Pokemon think you can beat me? Yeah, um, I have Pokemon that are at least level 60 or higher. I think I have all my Pokemon level 60 except for one of them, which is level 61. So he's guitar, Vin guitarist Vincent, he's sent down Magnemite. And the, battle, and the trainer battle music for the gyms, or the trainer battles, again, is really cool. If it's the same as the wild Pokemon, uh, the, the trainer should battle on routes and stuff. Um, just just dig. You know, all I need is an earthquake, because I only have 10 of those, so I might as well save a couple, which is not dig. Yeah, I'll lock on to an effect Sanders, sorry. This Magnemite is level 27 in Gen Doist, by the way. We take it out. We are 33 levels higher than this thing, so... There's really no doubt, right? <laughs> Here's Sander. Yeah, Sander's has 200 HP right now, right? Exactly. Awesome. Another Magnemite, huh? Okay, let's use another dig then. Let's see, this Magnemite is level 32 in Gen Duos, okay? So this one's 5 levels higher than the first one, but that's okay. Just gotta try to keep on using lock on. Dig hits again. Yeah, this is a pretty easy battle so far, I'm not gonna lie. This is about to use Fall Toy, okay. No, I will not switch Pokemon Sanders. This is gonna go for an epic Sand Slash Sweep right now, even though you're not a gym leader, but that's okay. Let's give it another dig. Sanders just loves to dig holes when I tell him to, right? <laughs> yeah, let's give self destruct. Okay, that just. Oh, I don't know if it'll hit. Yeah, it missed. Okay, good. How you trying to pull a fast one, I guess, but that's not gonna work, you stupid Fall Toy. And then he has another Magnemite, of course. I think that Voltorb is level 33, by the way, I could be wrong. Oh, and I still use, <laughs> and Zender still uses a dig, awesome. Nice. So that was an easy battle. This gym will be a piece of cake, to be honest, unless I really struggle for some reason, which I don't think I do struggle. So I'm pretty confident. Oh, how shocking. Thanks for the, the 1,024 Poker Dollars. I almost said 10,000, jeez. Another another battle right after, okay. I'm going to take you down, prepare to be shocked. We'll see about that. See you guys at the end of this battle. Okay, so Juggler Horton was defeated at four electrodes basically. I used two, um, two. I used one earthquake on one of them, another earthquake on another them, on another one of the electrodes, and then I used two digs on the remaining two, like one dig per the two remaining electrodes. So yeah, so it wasn't too bad. Go cool, ah, I was overpowered. Thanks for the one thousand three hundred twenty poker dollars. And here's the last train. I'm gonna skip to this battle like I said I would. <laughs> You're here to defeat Lieutenant Surge. Not if I can help it. We'll see about that. Yeah, Gentleman Gregory was defeated. Sanders is so close to level 61. I bet by the end of this part, it'll be, uh, Sanders will be level 61. Sorry, I failed your Lieutenant Surge. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, don't feel bad. I mean, it's okay. Thanks for 2,376 Poker Dollars. And look, the electric gates are not active, like the advice giver said, so we can just take on Lieutenant Surge now, so let's talk to him. Let's see, Lieutenant Surge, hey, you, you little tyke. I have, I have to hand it to you. It may not be very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. 
When it comes to electric Pokemon, I num I'm number one. I never lost on the battlefield. I'll zap you just like I did my enemies in war. Yeah, the gym battle music for uh, Kanto is also like, cool. Let's just listen to it for a second. Isn't that cool though? I like the music a lot, honestly. So yeah, here's a right, here's since I was right true. I don't I know, I forgot I forgot to see how many Pokemon he has. Such so as level 44 and male, so we're still 16 levels higher than this, so Sanders still 16 levels higher than this. Let's go for the uh, Earthquake, let's go for Quick Attack, of course. Does HP, they, it does 8 HP on Sanders. But, um, I believe this Earthquake will take it up, but you never know. We'll have to see, for sure. And it does, awesome, I was right, nice. Oh, so close level 61, jeez. Okay, so that's 5 Pokemon, okay, nice Magneton. Okay, yeah. Huh? I'll stay in. I'll stay in with Sanders. We're gonna go for another epic sense slash sweep. This so Magneton's level 40 in Gendo is. Okay, so we're still 20 levels higher than this thing. Let's get for the earthquake then. If you have a pure uh, ground type like a Dawn fan at this point or a sand slash like me, then this battle is gonna be a piece of cake. It's just so easy then, you know? Because electric type moves can't even affect your pure ground type, or even if it's half ground type, you know what I'm saying? It's awesome. Yeah, Sanders good level 61, awesome. Three more Pokemon left. Okay, so much as Electrod. Um, I think that I believe in Sanders, and I think he can take this thing out with the one Earthquake. This is Electrod's level 40, so it's still Sanders is still 20 levels higher than it. Actually, 20, 21 levels higher than actually now. That's just awesome. Let's see if this Earthquake takes it out, and it does. Awesome. So we've one shot all this Pokemon with just Earthquake. Really. Then again, I'm overwhelmed, but that's okay. Okay, let's go. Oh, Octobuzz, that's awesome. I've always wanted to use an Octobuzz on my team, but, uh, I don't know. I didn't use one in my Pokemon Fire Red, uh, Let's Live Stream series, which is exclusive to Fire Red, actually, for the generation between Leaf Green and Fire Red. And, yeah, I wish I would have used one, but, uh, maybe in the future if I do, like, a Pokemon redo of, well, I've already done a redo of Pokemon Leaf Green, and I, and I don't think you guys would want me to play through Kanto again, really, because, um, I did Pokemon Leaf Green, I did Pokemon Leaf Green Redo, I did Pokemon Fire Red Let's Live Stream Series, that's another one, and I did Pokemon Yellow. So I've, I've done Kanto like four times now on my channel. So I think I think I just kind of, uh, kind of like, dried that kind of thing out, you know, like, I don't, I'm trying to think of a better term, like, I kind of overdone that series, I guess you'd say. But yeah, that's good for the, the Earthquake Fancy. That that looked about level 46 in male, so we're still 15 levels higher than it, so that's awesome where Miss Sanders was. And this last Pokemon is a Electrode. So it's two Electrodes, a, a Magneton, an Electabuzz, and a Raichu. That's pretty cool. I think I said that right with all the Pokemon he had. So Electrode's also level 40 like the last one. Let's go for that Earthquake then. Cool. Yeah, nice. And the electrode goes down. Awesome. Widow turn search was defeated. Awesome. Ah, uh, you're too strong. <laughs> okay, you get the thunder badge. Awesome. Thanks for four six hundred pocket dollars. Steven received the thunder badge. Awesome. Nice. Thunder Badge increases Pokemon speed. Does it? Why well, are you just saying that? <laughs> Consider it proof that you defeated me. You want to, to, to you wear it proudly here? Okay. And I don't think any of the gym leaders in Kanto. Well, I, th I think Erica gives you gym leader. Or not gym leader, but like, Erica gives you a TM, which is a Giga Dream, which will eventually teach the Megan when we get there. But yeah. I don't think, yeah. Which, uh, Return Search doesn't give you a TM, apparently. Phew. That was an electrifying bout. Uh, immature made me nervous, so it's okay. Okay, so Vimon City Pokemon Gym Ludo, Lieutenant Surge, Winning Trainer, Steven. Awesome. So, let's rearrange our Pokemon here. Let's see, it's first up front, I guess. Yeah. So, I have my, four of my Pokemon are still level 60, two of them are level 61. Now, you, be, you might be wondering, where do we go next if... Oh, come on. 
That stupid tentacle interrupted me. You may, you may be wondering where to go next if th this way past Diglett's cave is blocked off by a giant snorx, and up north there is a person saying the road's the underground path that's closed until the power point issue gets solved. Well, okay, so what you want to do is still go north, but the, actually the transitional building between Vermilion City and Saffron City is still open, I believe. So I think that's where we have to go next. I'm going to go around the tall grass because I don't feel like Bernard Pell. So yeah, here's the transitional building. See, it's it's all good to go now. Now we're in Saffron City. How awesome! Um, I think you give us a TM for Psych, I guess. Yeah, I got it. You wanted this TM twenty nine, which is Psychic, which I already have Psychic for Mystic and for Subrosal. But can anyone else learn it? Actually, I'm gonna pull my um, final moves list again just to make sure. Okay, so I looked at my final moves set. I don't think anyone can learn Psychic other than Mystic and uh, Soul Bro Soul. But it'd be cool if Noctowl could learn Psychic, but I'm pretty sure, according to my final moves set, he still has confusion over um, any Psychic type move like that or Psychic move in general. I should put the Metal Code in my piece, like I promised, I thought I forgot about that. But yeah, let's just double check because it's really nice to have a third Pokemon have Psychic, but then again, what are you gonna do? Okay, the, oh, okay, Mystic and Force of the Lens can learn action of mine. Okay, let's put my bag then, forever. <laughs> okay. Let's hop on a bike to go a little bit faster. Here we go. Um. Hmm. I think we can do this copycat thing real quick, hopefully. Yeah, I forget where to go though to get it, but I think it's like. I think it's in the morning city actually now that I think about it. Wow. Okay. Uh, well, yeah, there you go. Steven says, Hi, do you like Pokemon? Uh, no, I just asked you. Huh? You're strange. Hmm, quit mimicking, mimicking, but that's my favorite hobby. I think, um, I think we'll have to come back here later because I don't think that the uh, objective or the mission or the, whatever you want to call it is not going to be activated until later on. But just know that that's of existence, in existence, I guess. Here's the magnet train. I'm sorry, but the magnet train isn't operating now. Okay. I think he, I think if you talk to him again, he makes this joke by saying, Well, I can carry all the passengers with my back, or something like that. This is a transitional building, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's just keep on you, I guess. We get the focus band, which is pretty cool. I forget what the focus band even does. Hello. Karate King, the do the Jojo's uh, master, is in for in a cave in Jodo for training. Okay, so this is where we get him on the Hermon Chan. You can only pick one of the two, though, in the original games and in the Fire Leaf Green. There's a gym if I want to take it on. Which is pretty tempting, actually. I might want to do that next part, honestly. But, uh. Yeah. Let's put a um, Mystic up front for the gym then. And I don't think our trainer card shows any Kanto badge, which kind of stinks. It only shows the Jodo badge. Dang it, that's that's a shame. I think in Huckle and Soul Silver, they do show the Kanto badges, but I could be wrong on that. So, uh, is there anything else I want to do? I wanna, uh, off screen, I will put my metal coat in the PC, along with the focus band. For, maybe prevent fainting. Who doesn't have an item? That's a, that's a good question. Sanders doesn't have an item. And Mystic doesn't have an item. Let's give it to Sanders. Yeah, I made sense. Show the focus band. Cool. Nice. I guess we can give this smoke ball to uh, Mystic, I guess. Just in case like, we need to run away from a battle. And I'll have, always have references that, that we can just run away from a battle if I don't want to faint for experience. Be yeah, off screen, I'll put the Metal Coat on the PC. And the next part, we'll take on the Saffron City Pokemon Gym, which is right here Saffron City Pokemon Gym. We to Sabrina. Um, yeah, the Master of Psychic Pokemon, awesome. So yeah, so this has been then my Pokemon Crystal Walk the Good Part. Next part, we we'll take on the Stuff and Save Pokemon Gym and take on Leader Sabrina and all the trainers in the gym. Although, again, I'll do the same formula for Lieutenant Surge Gym back in Vimwin City, where I just, you know, battle the first trainer I run into, show that battle, and then the rest of the trainers uh, in the gym, I'll just skip to the end. And yeah, it's gonna be fun. And also, uh, I can't wait to battle Sabrina again, you know, because Sabrina's a cool gym leader of Kanto, like, one of, in my top three. I'd say I, I like Blaine the best, then Erica, then probably Sabrina, honestly, because they're just so cool. 
the cool gym leaders. So yeah, this has been Janko again. I would like to see you goodbye, and I'll just see you guys next time my Pokemon Crystal Walk the Guide. <laughs>